This is a MO Compact 900. That means that's our compact machine up to a pipe diameter of 900 mm or 36 inch. We have a fully automatic logistics system for loading and unloading of the pipe before cutting and after cutting. Here we have the infeed rack, so you can stack several pipes on the infeed rack and then the operator can push a button and one pipe will roll over on the infeed conveyor and then it will be automatically motorized conveyed into the cutting conveyor. The machine can run pipe diameters from 50 millimeter to 900 or two inch to 36 inch. We need to height adjust the chuck. This is fully automatic when the operator puts in the diameter of the pipe, the chuck will adjust to the right height itself. The pipe is clamped here in the chuck and when we start cutting the pipe, our cutting head comes down. We have here an electromechanical tracer this is a sensor which traces the pipe mechanically and then the CNC automatically will compensate for all effects like oval pipe and banana shaped pipes. Our machine has a unique six CNC concept. We have first axis, the rotation of the pipe, the Y axis. Second axis, our pipe machine can move on the X axis along the X ray all the way. The third axis is the 380 degree rotation of the C axis of the complete cutting head that means 360 for a hole plus 20 degrees for lead in and lead out lines. You can see here this half moon shape. This is for the bevel angles. We can do with this machine plus minus 60 degree bevel angle because sometimes you need more than 45 degrees. And then we have two quality or compensation accents on our machine. The first one is the whole cutting head can go up and down so we can compensate for any ovality of our banana shape of the pipe. The second axis is the W axis. This is a special unique feature of our machine. So we can move the plasma torch forwards and backwards according to what is needed. And this means as well that if the pipe has a weld seam, for example, when we cut off bevel the weld seam, we will have, our machine will cut here. Now the weld seam comes. And when the weld seam comes, our torch will not go up and down. Then we would have a nose sticking out of beveled off cut. What our machine will do automatically, it will retract the torch and after the weld seam it comes back so we have a smooth nice cut on the side. On the other side of the machine we have the x-ray. Here what is very important as well for the precision and quality of the cuts is that our machines are complete in all axes with these linear guiding systems, even on the x-axis and as well on all the other axes internally in the machine. We have as well a very sturdy and solid inclined rack and pinion drive. You can see this here. This rack and pinion drive is approximately 30 millimeters high, but this gives us a very long lasting and long living reliable machine, which will still many years after use cut in a very good accurate cutting quality.